Hi, in this exercise we have to determine the horizontal and vertical components of reactions at point A and C. So we start the solution procedures. The first step, as I said, we go to units and make them metric. Now we have to define the grid. Uh, we have uh, 0, 2 and 4. And in this direction, we have 0 and 1.5. 0, 2, and 4. 0 and 1.5. We start plotting. Click on drag. First point second point and the last point now we have to determine the supports we have here hinge and here we have hinge and also here we have hinge notice that if we don't mention this one as hinged uh, the results will be different we go again to auto disk robot and from support we have fixed this is the first point and here we have hinged that is bent see here this is the shape of the support pay attention to the direction of the support we want it to be rotated at 90 degrees so we edit bent let's name it as bent 2 and direction minus 90 add uh, pin 2 but before that remove this one and add this one okay it's the correct one now we have to determine loads we have here distributed loads of 3 kN per meter and here we have concentrate, concentrated load of 8 kN so this load is at a distance of 2 meters from the beginning of this segment um, we add load types dead load 1 for self weight and dead load 2 for added weight and from here we have bar weight distributed minus minus 3 correct we add it here now we have concentrated one minus 8 correct and we want it on the co uh, local coordinated system co uh, coordinate system we can show the co uh, co local coordinate system from here model local system as you see here the red one is the direction of z-axis so the negative uh, z-axis is at this direction so uh, from the beginning the distance from here up to here is 2 so we make it absolute and 2 okay close it now to see the values of loads click here and here this is the loads now start the analysis okay now we have to turn on the results the reactions and as I told you at the beginning if we don't make this one as pinned the results will be different let's see, the, see them and after that we make it as a pin see how much is the results 9.41 7.87 9 9.87 9.41 there is a slight different difference and in this direction we have 12.64 uh, 67 sorry 
we have 14.7 there is a big difference to define the connection between these two segments we go to geometry and from here releases we choose pinned pinned and add it here uh, select the first one and the second one then close it after that start the analysis again yes yes never mind okay now we have to compare the results as you see here we have here 14.7 and 3 at point C and 14.67 and we have 3 that's correct and for point A we have 9.87 and 9.4 we have to see them here 9.87 and 9.4 and as you notice this, these are the same so this is the end of this video if you have any question just write it in the description below please do not forget to subscribe and like and share bye